I just want to give praise to Jesus for uh, last month the trip that we had to uh, Texas, Houston. Yes. And um, thank you all for your prayers, for your support, uh, financially as well, for this trip. Because the Lord moved in such a powerful way. And he's so helpful when he get out of our comfort zone. Hallelujah. God is moving. He just wants a little sacrifice. A little bit to do something. Uh, to get out of yourself. To get out of your security. To get out of your, you know, like pride if you want. Just to make the first step. And he's with us. Hallelujah. So we had a wonderful trip. God put so many people in our path to minister to. And we were in the biggest church in America, Lakewood, praise God. Yeah. He sent us there, we were like, you know, um, on a mission. And God put us with the right people. I don't want to tell you all, um, you maybe saw already everything on social media. <laughs> praise God for the new divine connections because yes. we are all on assignment. We all have ministry uh, calling from God. And when you are walking with Jesus, he is putting the right people on your path. He, he, as long as you walk on his way. And the most important is to be obedient to walk in his power and anointing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So I want to give praise to God. It was a very successful trip. From this trip, actually, we got connected with new ministers, new people that we want to travel during uh, 2024. Amen. And it's fulfilling what the Lord says about 2024. It's going to be a, oh. a time of taking Whoa. new things. Oh, 
And somebody want to stay. Yeah. <laughs> and the Holy Spirit wants to dwell in this place. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Because he's calling. He's calling. Yes. This is God. The Holy yes. Spirit is God. Yes. In order he to yes. come in, you gotta get up. <laughs> you gotta get up. <laughs> <laughs> Your mind, your emotions, you have to be submitted to the Holy Spirit. Amen. And then you're going to hear the voice of God. Because if you have agenda, you will never hear the voice of God. Because you already know. And the revival and the move of God has nothing to do with your intellectual knowledge. It's nothing to do with your right. mind and your brain and your thinking, thinking, thinking. Right. It's all about the Holy Spirit that lives inside of us. Yes. Yes. Many people say, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit is not here. Let me tell you something, a little bit anatomy, you know, the, this is our emotions. This is here, my heart. The Bible says the heart is the most deceiving of all. <laughs> so whatever you want, oh God, give me the desire of my heart. Oh, no, 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 don't give me the desire of my heart. Oh, no, 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 no. Let me be clear. I want to put that desire down. I'm putting my agenda, agendas down. I'm putting my shame. I'm putting my desires. I'm putting my ambitions down to let him rise in me. And then his will is going to be done in my life. And, and many times we are preaching, it's very easy to serve God when you're in the spirit. When you hear prophetic word that God has for you and you're like, hallelujah. Because you're in the presence of God and you can promise anything in the presence of God. I can many people say like, sister, I'm going to call you and cash up you. Oh, sister, I'm going to donate for your ministry mm -hmm. in the presence of God and then disappear. Right. Because when you, when God speaks to them in the presence of God, then the flesh comes and says like, oh no. <laughs> you know? So when you hear the voice of God, in the presence of God, make your mind that you're going to follow the guidance of the Holy Spirit. When God is speaking to you, for your calling, it's announced in the spiritual realm. And you know what? Not only God heard it, and the angels of the Lord heard it, but Satan also heard it. Yes. And he knows he is always, the devil is always on the work 24-7 to destroy you, to prevent you, block you, sabotage your walk with Jesus. Mm -hmm. So you cannot be lukewarm Christian because you cannot... Fight against the spiritual being with your flesh. Amen. The devil is a spirit. He's a fallen angel. Yes. So, so you know, we are not afraid from him because we are covered by the blood of Jesus. We are in Christ. But let me tell you something. Many Christians are trying to f fight demonic forces and addictions and things that are caused by demons with their flesh. Or go to a faith program. 12 steps, you're going to be free. Who is free? Yes. That's a demon. The spirit of alcohol, alcohol is yes. an addiction. Yeah. Oh, go to this program, you're going to be free from, free from, from pornography watching and your addiction. But I don't believe that. You might know it's wrong, but you will never be free. Because that's a demon. And you're trying to fight what is spiritual with your flesh. That's not going to work. So in order you to be free, you have to come in the presence of God and say, Lord, yes. I'm submitting, I'm surrendering. I cannot fight it If we can do it with our flesh, Jesus did not have to come to die on the cross. But he did because he knew that we cannot fulfill the law with our flesh. And we cannot serve God with our flesh. So he came to pay a big price. And it's not just to end one day we to be with Jesus in heaven. Hallelujah. We all anticipate when Jesus comes. The church of God says, Amen. Come, Lord Jesus. But until then, hallelujah. 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 God called us to live victorious life. If we get trust in our Lord and Savior, we're going to beat the devil every day. Not us, but the Holy Spirit. The more you come close, the closer you come to Jesus, the more you realize how much more you need yes. him. So the further you are from Jesus, you say, I can do it by myself. That's why what we want to do tonight is, Lord, forgive me for my, my unbelief. Yes. Yes. Forgive me, Lord, for my pride and taking the things in my hands. Amen. I'm laying everything before you, God, and I cannot fight with this disease. I cannot fight with this addiction. I cannot fight evil without you, Jesus. Yes. I might acknowledge it. I might think, I can say, I can point a finger, but I have no ability on myself to do it. 
Yeah, this is where your dependency comes. The dependency of the Holy Spirit. Who says the Bible says he mortifies the deeds of the flesh. Hallelujah. There is hope. Hallelujah. Then when the Holy Spirit comes in you, he's going to mortify the deeds of the flesh and you're going to have a victorious life. Hallelujah. Yes. So I just wanted to warm you up a little bit. <laughs> Understanding and revelation and knowledge of what he's speaking because what the, what the Holy Spirit is speaking is already written in the Bible, he's not going to get out of this flame. So, I want to introduce to you to those that don't know my crazy for Jesus. <laughs> 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 Go 
go another direction. <laughs> this is another story. Marshal to the Adesh. He bought Dava go out. Toy Dava Kanger. He's giving a hunger. Bokas was Yama to be done, Samu to what I do. Most of the God says, I'm not going to give you just like the Bible, what you can read about me, read about me. I want you to understand me correctly. But, uh, all of us, we stay firmly of the word of yes. the Lord. You cannot move without knowing the scripture. But I want to tell you something. You cannot just read the Bible and that's it. You cannot operate and do and fulfill what God has for you without the Holy Spirit. If you think that, if you think that God has called you into ministry, if you think that reading the Bible you're going to figure it out how to do it, you're going to get confused. You're going to be totally out there. You're standing in front of people and you're going to be wondering what you're doing. Ако искаш да си тръгваш, тръгвай си сега. 
Non sa niente di sopra. Ti scappa di casa. C'è niente di suo cima da ancora. Chi è suo cima da schiacci da tu? 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 To vas znači toj i nikoj drug. That means he is number one and nobody else is there. Ako samo se pojavi nekoj na radara. If somebody else tried to take his place on the radar. Pao! Niko nja! Niko nja! Nja! No! 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 Tam ne može nikoj da ima. You cannot allow anybody to sit on this throne. A si iskam da mnogo vas, vi znajte koliko običam Angelina? You know? I want to tell you about my wife, Angelina. And our daughter, Claude. Claude. I want to tell you about it. But I want to tell you, in the last 16 years ago, God put me on the earth on the last time. There was the seventh time when Jesus took me to heaven. I want to tell you, when Jesus was walking on the streets of God with Jesus, I told me to go to the church of the Canadian Church. And he showed me the house of my of my father in heaven. I came to the church of the Canadian Church. And I saw I saw the house of my this is his earthly father that passed away 16 years ago. And then I have Jesus. I mean, can I ask this? Can the servant not have a job? And Jesus, please don't don't let me go to the earth. I want to stay here. As near as God's power, no. I have nothing to do on the earth. Jesus, Vika. Ти имаш семейство, ти имаш дъщеря, и аз сега, Боже, много ги обичам. Погрижи се за тях, но аз ще остана тук. Аз ще остана тук и аз го държах си урна. О, аз го държах си урна. Ако ми прегръща много, не се върна. Искам да ви кажа, в този момент Исус е наистина най-голямата любов, която може да ви видите. Тя ме разтопи и в този момент беше много нежен. Леко ме попутва. Аз те връщам на земя. Защото ти имаш работа за мен, дали? И ти имаш много работа за мен! И аз тогава казах, Yes, Lord, Матуле! Вече бях в това момента. Така че нямаше как. И вече не ме взима, 16 години не ме взима. И аз мисля, че дори няма да ме взема. Защото този път вече ще си върши бою. Но искам да ме съзначаме тази вечера. Че Бог е жив! Нашия Бог е жив! Нашия Бог е жив! Нашия Бог е жив! И святия Дух е третото лице на Бога! И вие, когато го имате, имате ги в себе си, тогава ви имате всичко. Тогава Бог ще ви прати правилните хора в живота. Тогава ви ще ви лиши хора в живота. Тогава ще видиш как Джезабел Бог ще го махне от твоя живот. Ти ще видиш как демоните си отиват. Ти ще видиш как Святия Дух се отвиди мощно в твоя живот. Не само на службите. Не само когато заставаш пред хората. Ти ще чувстваш Божието присъствие. Отставането си! И когато легнеш, ти ще чувстваш святия дух, да се движи в душата на канта на Мария. Ай! И ти ще живееш с Исус. Ти ще живееш с Исус. И тогава няма да се чудиш. Как да кажеш на някои? О, как ще го кажа за Исус? О, той няма да прие. Разбира се, като го говориш глупости, няма да прие. О, ако ти начинаш да говориш глупости, няма да прие. Ето, стюпи, 
because uh, yes. stupid uh, yes. uh, uh, this person <laughs> don't receive uh, the people will not receive Jesus but the Holy so Spirit God. but the Holy Spirit the Holy Spirit two cents one cents for Holy Spirit if this man receive Jesus yes now. amen, amen. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> thank Jesus thank Jesus Приемете Святия Дух. Приемете Святия Дух. Приемете Святия Дух. Приемете ли Святия Дух? Вие имате всичко. Вие имате Святия Дух. Вие имате всичко. 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 Вие имате
Свидетели, които говорят за дявола. И не ги пита дявола, какво му прави на човека. Ма дявол е лъжец. Дявол е лъжец. Дявол е лъжец. И не ме интересува кой е плана на човека. И не ме интересува кой е станал с този човек. И аз не ме интересува какво е правил този човек. Аз познавам един, който е Jesus Christ, който умря за всеки един грях. И нас не ми интересува дали си спал с какво си спал. Не е важно какво си правил. Не е важно какво дяволът те е връзвал. Искам да ти кажа, че Исус дойде точно за тебе. Точно за тебе. За да те освободи. За да ти не бе сила. За да кажа, не бой се на ово стадо. Не бой се, чадо мое. Защото дяволът е лъжец. Дяволът е лъжец. Дяволът е лъжец. И всичко това е лъжа. Но истината съм аз. Това е живота, който Бог ни е отдадил. Аз вярвам, че всички ни искаме готов живот. И аз да ви кажа честно. В началото бях много найс. И давах времето си. Време, слушах на тези хора, искам да ги променя. И един ден, и един ден, аз бях на големе. И Святия Дух ми тъм. Кириле, ти мислиш ли, че ти си по-добър от мен? И мислиш ли, че ти наистина можеш да направиш нещо за тия хора, когато те не искат. След време, Бог ме заведе в Ада. Три тани. С Исус бях. Искам да ви кажа, че Ада е пълен с nice people. Така че ако искаш да бъдеш nice, и това да ти е единственото, което ще ходиш на неделя. Това почти няма да ти помогна. Няма да ти помогна. Няма да ти помогна. Бог иска един жив, живо отношение с Него. Той иска Той и ти и никой друг. Така че това е желанието на Бог. И най-бърза за молитва. Ако искате да ви я кажа, да си сигнат, само кажи Господи, ето ме, в момента в който кажеш, change me, о, той почва, о, той почва, о, той почва, и пута о да траш, и целият траш си отива. И ти тогава ставаш повече от победител, тогава ти ставаш изпълнен с Холи Спина и Бог разбира се ще ти каже да простиш на тия демони. Но трябва да вървиш напред. Тенки Джинсен, това е Словото. Това е Святия Дух. Това е да чуваш Божия глас. Да не се плашиш. Ако Бог те е призовал да бъдеш профетес, трябва да бъдеш наясно, че много хора, мени, 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 ще те погледнат. Точно ти. Кой си ти? Кой си ти? О, да си стурай дебо. Стурай дебо. Бай. Ти си 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 си
Ако ти не го приемеш по този начин, ти ще страдаш, ти ще плачеш, ти ще се чудиш как да победиш. Но Бог ти казва, ако ти се плашиш от една пърса, Бог ще ти доведе до три. Просто за да ти покаже, за да ти покаже, че ти си повече от победител. Че ти си повече от победител. Че ти си повече от победител. Не защото си ти. А защото Той е в тебе. Дявола няма власт. Той е стюбит. И Той е много лимит. Така че Той използва едно и също. И искам да ви кажа, ако ти вървиш за Святия Дух, ако ти слушаш Святия Дух, ти ще си повече от победител. Повече от победител. Повече от победител. И Святия Дух ще се движи лошо. И Бог ще ви благославя. И Бог ще бъде с вас. Now and forever. Amen.